and these lips. What out? I don't think that's how it goes. You just gotta let my love, let my love, let my love adore you. Okay, so Gemini, somebody wants you to let their love adore you. Okay, I wanted to start off with Aquarius, but why not? Okay, you got a lot of good luck. Okay, enjoyment at work. We are gonna do three cards. We gonna take that one. What was that? Come on, drop it. I smell a relationship ship coming in, coming in. I know that's right in, coming in. Okay, so. Mm. Gemini, sorry. We got enjoying work at life, good luck, victory, um, speaking truth, change by choice, and we got horseshoe. Good luck, protection, success, caring, um, spouse, unique opportunity, take them, okay? You know how, you know how some people be praying, they be like, oh my God, I always want a good person, and then finally when God send you that good person, you get weirded out, you ain't think the universe or God wasn't hearing you? Ciao. All right, let's see what's going on, working and enjoying life. <laughs> the fool, you got a new beginning. Okay, I feel like you've been dealing with a lot of scattered energy, like stress, conflict. I feel like you see that if you don't have your money right, you can be a little frustrated, coming clean, you know. And I feel like you was having inner turmoil and you're moving on from that, like whatever trauma, um, heartbreak, recovering, grief. Which my condolences because that's really hard. Okay, negative self talk. Um, I feel like this new job, yeah, you're kind of tired of the old you. It's like someone expecting the old them to get them far, and it's not. It's just like you're taking action and understanding that you have to do something different. And I feel like don't let your emotions control you where it's like, oh, you miss out on the opportunity because, you know, yeah don't miss out an opportunity because whatever thinking you have going on i feel like you're done giving people from the past a chance mm. i feel like someone really broke your trust you're about to get the world for that all right but yeah speaking your truth you're going through something where you're gonna have like curious and starting a new life you're about to have your ten of cups mm-hmm the future is up to you, Gemini. So it's like, it's basically giving me my emotions. Like, you know, not my emotions, but your emotions. Like, let's say, like, your friend saying it's a pool party or it's a time to go out, but you just in your feeling. You know how sometimes in a breakup, like, you know, you just want to stay in. You don't want to be bothered. But do you think the person that broke your heart is in the house? No. And we, we, we know that you're a loyal, good person. But how long are you going to stay inside? You can't stay inside forever. I see you in the blanket. Or playing your PlayStation 5. Hearing me being like, yeah, you're right. But home is where the heart is, right? Home is where the heart is. Gemini. Yeah, something about fixing your credit. You could be seeing frogs, butterflies. There's a Libra coming into your life to bring you justice. It could even be a friend of yours. Yeah, you got to be like, oh, well, bye, Rocco. And you could be seeing bees. There's no spiritual blockages. Okay, Gemini? I feel like it's your mindset. Maybe you should try meditating. What's this card? Sudden cash flow. Come on now. Might take this opportunity. Okay? You feel me? Here's your energy. I feel like quiet power in the truth. But don't do mind games and misuse power. Especially if you have someone that's putting you on something to make money. It could be vending machine. It could be flipping cars. Don't slime that person out. Because I feel like you'll be doing it all and carrying the burden and struggling. But you will succeed. But it's like, don't be that person that know it all. Because sometimes it takes a friend to tell you something. And then you, you know how like someone comes to you with the idea. And then you, you, you start being like, 
oh yeah oh i knew but you wouldn't knew if this person went opening mouth it's like someone asking how to make money on like uber eats as a driver to make some extra quick money that you'll get paid instantly today you feel me because you your ego you know i don't have no flaw i ain't doing nothing wrong yeah you did okay i feel like they're gonna accept your apology but you gotta be careful because it, it, it's gonna be like a personal setback they're gonna forgive you and i think for some they're not gonna forgive you um yeah Learn the art of detachment. You having a lot of confident independence and zest for life. But it's going to be a lot of self-forgiveness, okay? Just don't let your ego get to you. Because if you see in this reading, you have a option. Because this is for May to change this, to get to your Ten of Pentacles, okay? I, I, I kid you not. Uh, you got a lot of love and lust entering your life, building, growing. After a Ten of Swords, after being betrayed and bullied, someone could have made fun of you. The king of wands. I feel like you're career focused. Like, if it ain't about no money, don't be calling me up. Dun, 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 dun. It ain't about no money. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. I feel like you're releasing fear. I feel like you're noticing everything's energy and you have to believe in yourself. What's this one? Yeah, you need a teamwork to collab. You might think there's nobody to collab with you, but I feel like there is. Mm. You just gotta stay away from ladies that's very jealous. I see a Virgo in reverse. Um, Queen of Pentacles, somebody who's codependent, mistrusting, okay? Um, I feel like you gotta stay away from love for a little bit. For some of y'all. Because, um, especially if you didn't heal your traumas, that's what it's giving. If you don't heal your traumas, you're going to keep attracting codependent people that are kind of like reminding you of your mom. So if your mom was very like self-centered, she would blame you of what was going on and then you help her financially. It's like someone who take, take, take instead of give, give, give. Okay. And then you're repressing your emotions. So you're not even addressing the situation. You just let someone walk all over you like a doormat. Okay. And it's causing blockages in your sacred and your root chakra. Okay, the emperor. Here's your energy. You just gotta stand up for yourself. I feel like, or just don't tell this person your success plans. Because I feel like if you move in silence with the nine of wands and the sun, you will be good. You know, people will test your boundaries, but say, hey, I don't got it. What they gonna do, hurt you? Because you don't got it? Tell your mom no. It's smuttering. Like, you know? Because whoever this person is, they are self-centered. Because heavy on a Virgo. Um, jealousy. Um, mistrusting. A lot of confusion. I feel like you're getting air into clarity. And like, yeah, you're procrastinating and staying stuck. For some of y'all, you may need to ask a, a therapist, you know. And ask why you attract that. But many of y'all, y'all are attracting an emperor, a queen of wands. Heavy on a fire sign. Like, you're attracting a fire sign, earth sign. For some of y'all, even a water sign into your life that is healthy for you. For some of y'all, y'all you are still in this karmic relationship. I said some. So take what resonates. And, um, I don't know. Maybe it's hard to get away from this person. But... That's y'all messages for the month of May. I feel like a lot of money. I just feel like don't, you know, be like bigger than a group or, um, you know. Also, journaling can help you with talking about things that you go through. Um, mm -hmm. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and make your own meal preps. I feel like you can heal yourself by talking through your food and um, putting the love in your food. But yeah, that's what I got for you guys. Um, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see y'all later. Bye.